Hello there, I'm Dr. D2 and this is Dungeon Nightmares 2, the full release. I played part 1 and the demo a while ago, but this one came out and I'm looking forward to it because Dungeon Nightmares 1 was probably one of the scariest games I've played because you actually had to go around and escape stuff. Before we go in though, Personal Journal has several things to keep track of as you do things, including stuff like secret walls, newspapers, so I've got to look out for lots of stuff. More importantly, you can track how many times you have beat a bloat. Everyone's made that joke about this game, I bet. There's a jump? Well, jump is an option. Okay, let's start. Paver Nocturnus. A disorder of sleep characterized by a dream of terrifying dimensions far worse than a typical nightmare. Whoa! Okay... Well... That's not what happened in the demo. Yes, it is. That's a pretty messed up picture. Okay, so, um... This is not what the demo had. In the demo, we started in, a, in an apartment room of some kind. Whoa, what the... A little girl spoke to me today. She has the same name as me. I, Nunez, what? I don't want any gold. Okay! I agree with that, actually. Why did you start me off in the elevator? Th this is not what the demo promised. I was supposed to be able to choose when I go in there. Also, why'd you start me off with the music that means Mary's around? I don't like Mary. Oh, crap. This room... Oh, no, don't. I want to close the map. Probably shouldn't sprint. Mary's when I have to sprint. Well, I forgot how claustrophobic and intimidating everything was here. But if I remember right, I can keep calm and... I can escape her by closing the door. Except I haven't run across a single door. Instead, I've just turned around and gone back the way I came. Okay. I'm gonna go back the other way. I forgot what I was looking for. What the? Oh, okay. Well, you have definitely expanded the game a bit. Oh good, an elevator. And a dead guy. And a fly. I like that you're not collecting gold this time, because you know... Yeah, 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 screw this. Get out of here. So slow. Get out of here. Ah, much better. Okay. You know, it didn't make... It, it never made sense in the first game that you collected gold, because why would you have a score to keep when you're running from something that's going to eat your skin? Putting a score on something really, really diminishes the fear of it. What does it mean? Hasn't stopped raining for over two weeks. There's more stuff to interact with in the environment than last time. That's cool. Well, gonna look around a bit, see what else has changed since, you know, so far. Even the bed's different, if I think. And again, it's still using the same clock as my computer, so... Off with you. Little bit of immersion. Do they actually- I don't think anyone actually still plays that at the end of their broadcast day. 
I don't think channels still have an end to their broadcast day. What is that? No, open that up. I want this thing. Can't open it. Well... Uh, my mirror sucks. Can't really see myself. Good flushing. I am really, really scared of the idea of taking a shower, apparently. Hello, old painting that I hate. Hello, teddy bear. I should leave the bear here in case they come back. I know this painting. I can't enter right now. So far, this part's what I remember. Except mattress. That mattress wasn't there. Why is there a mattress here? 305 is locked. That's a different message, so that's good. 304 is not my room. You got that right. So, if it's like the last game, then there'll be an elevator at the other end, and... That's about it. Okay, gotta wait for the little text to catch up and tell me what the bars mean. Do I see something? I don't think I see something. No, there's nothing in there. Haven't played a horror game for a while, so I'm, I've lost my ability to adapt to the atmosphere. Or, not... I am not adapted to the atmosphere at the moment. Well, that's not right. I wonder what's in the staff room. Oh, that's just light on the wood. That's why I thought it looked weird. It looked like a piece of paper. Well, thankfully that first little dungeon was pretty short. So we should have plenty of time to get through this one. I wonder why they all say something different. Well, once more... Whoa. Okay. So, you're having some trouble when I get in there. That's okay. I understand. Ah, uh, you took away the one candle I had. This doesn't look right. This doesn't look right at all. Wait until you get off the elevator. But whoa! Look for clues. Okay, that's different. Also, well, that's just like schoolgirl missing. Search for missing girl 16 continues. A chartered Douglas DC-8 plane crashes in Sri Lanka, killing 183. Harold Pinter's Betrayal premieres in London. All right, I'm only going to read the left one because I think that's the important one. A frantic search is underway for a missing 16-year-old girl who disappeared over the weekend after setting off a to visit a friend's house. She was last seen walking as she left her home at around 12.30 p.m. on Saturday. Yesterday, investigators joined police officers from 40 departments to search through the night for any sign of the or any trace of the girl. No. Oh, okay. It looks reasonably important. Optional newspaper found. Well, that is something I would actually search these dungeons for, despite the fact that it's a horrible, horrible idea. So I gotta recognize that that's what a secret door looks like. Let's see if there's another one first. At least the fact that that door is there tells me Mary couldn't have attacked me while I was in here. Unfortunately, I also haven't faced her yet, which means it's... I'm not going to look forward to when I actually do. And... What the... Come on, get out. 
The fact that these doors are not actual doors like they were last time, which means that... Please just be that. Please just be that. Oh, I don't like this. I can see pretty decently though, so that's okay. This room is a dead end. Oh good, dead ends are good. It's big and open, it means it can give me room to escape. All right. Um. That's how I turn on the elevator, isn't it? So I need to find a switch instead of a key or something. No, I need to find keys, that's right. What was that? I actually put down the map because I thought I saw something over there. Put it down, there wasn't anything there. Then I heard a sound. I'm just repeating myself. Open the wall. Get out of my sight. Okay. I'll... Well, you're different. Are you like a? Are you an eyeball or you're an eyeball that's on a table? Well, I don't like you. Oh, I don't like this. Weird view of the map. Why can't I zoom out on it? That's not a clue. Okay. See, I know Mary's in here somewhere. She's gotta be. Is there a faster way to do that? Can I crush Mary with bricks? That'd be cool. No other secret door here. The secret doors appear on the map, so that doesn't make them very well hidden. But, I must say, the demo was really just a slightly expanded version of what Dungeon Nightmares 1 was. This... You got rid of doors. I missed the doors. But my point is, this has actually changed a bit. You've actually done stuff to... that I don't expect. That's... Please don't tell me I won't. There's nowhere to go. So I'm gonna walk up into her and she's gonna be there. This is the only way to go. Now, if it's the beginning, what's at the beginning of? Okay. Okay. Is it the beginning of renovations? Is it the beginning of. Is that the... That's not something. What? Where am I? I don't like where I am. Yeah. You've done a good job of making everything... A door! You... Traitor! What the... Okay. Okay. Can I open you now? What? What was that? Oh, hi. It's a skeleton. Okay. Took a candle. I remember how you work. You move when I don't look at you. So I just gotta mostly look at you because I gotta open this. What's that? March 2000. I miss home. Kay Strickland. I don't know... Who that is. Okay. So I do need to find the key to find the exit. It's probably in one of those two paths. Goodbye. Screw you, skeleton. I forgot. Yeah, yeah, this one's doing a good job doing what the last one did, because I want to get the hell out of here. Please don't stab me, door. You do there's a candle in the sky. Why is there a candle in the sky? Another secret door wall here. Yeah, I I just want to go home, please. I just want to go home, please. This is a dead end. Well, that look at the bright side. That means there's only one way the exit could be. So I'm gonna go that way and pretend this is just a happy, light-filled place with with line puzzles. Yeah, 
This place just has, this is the wrong way. No, it's not the wrong way. What the crap was that? Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. The exit's right ahead. Except Mary wanders the halls at random, so, and I haven't reached her yet. So either she went from here to where I've already been, and I'm really lucky, or she's up ahead, and I am boned. How much you want to bet I'm boned? Oh, I am boned. I am boned. Should I be using candles? I have a feeling if I use a candle, she's gonna see me. All I need is a that's a guillotine. I'll check that in a bit. Although, once again, that'd be kind of cool if I could use that to kill Mary, cause. You know what, screw Mary. She's like the mildest threat of everything because I don't know what else is in this game. I'm just in the ramble mode because I want to get the hell out of this place. Yeah, that's a dead end. That's also a dead end. So that's where I'm going to go next. It looks like it wraps around to the left with another dead end. Oh, shit! Oh, crap. Oh, crap. This way, please. This way, please. Which way are you coming? Goodbye. 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 So long. Until we meet again. Open this up really fast. I don't need gold. Screw gold. Why am I still opening stuff? I need to get the hell out of here. In the guillotine room. In the guillotine room. Don't forget to save your... Oh, crap. I shouldn't have been sprinting the whole time. But she's down there. She's down there. She's down there and I don't have to go down there. I get to go back this way where she is not. At least, oh, yeah, yeah, screw it, bye. Whoa, what? don't care, don't care. Why? No, hang on. There might be a newspaper. There's not. Okay. Okay. We're out of here. <clears throat> Go to hell, Mary! I don't need that right now! I have the key, the key, the key, the key, the key to room 313. I'm not going there yet. I need to stop for a second. I forgot how badly this series really messed with me. So, thank you very much for watching. I hope you're enjoying this. I'm not. If you have anything else you'd like for me to play, please let me know in the comments below. And I hope you'll be back next time, though I can understand if you won't be. Later!